Hi everyone, my name is Sheila Levery and I'm the course coordinator of Intergroup and Individual Processes. Uh, this is a module that was specifically designed for this master's program in applied social psychology and I'd like to tell you a little bit about it. Um, this module basically focuses on the two aspects of social interaction. The first one is of course how we interact with each other, how we view each other, um, how we relate to each other as individuals. And the second aspect is how our group identity can influence um, the way we view each other and basically all these processes of the interaction. Um, the idea is that on the one hand, we're going to give you really in-depth understanding of why people behave the way they do in certain social situations and um, how these depend on the context. Um, and importantly, um, once you have this knowledge, you'll really be able to apply it in the future to other contexts in your work. Um, so I'm going to give you a few examples of the type of things that we're going to cover. Uh, so the first half of the module really focuses more on the inter-individual processes. So we'll cover topics such as empathy, communication, perspective taking, which is the ability to understand that other people might not have the same knowledge or views as you do. And we're going to learn many things that might surprise you. For example, you're going to learn that um, we're better at perspective taking with strangers than we are with friends, or that our ability to take each other's perspective depends on how busy we are or on how much power we have in the situations. And basically, once you understand that, you can also better understand how to ensure that in certain work situations, there'll be better perspective taking. Um, similarly, we're going to talk about communication, and then we're going to talk how our body language or our language really influences um, how much other people like us or how they view us. And again, you can think about how you might use that in the future in marketing or client service and so forth. Uh, the second half of the course looks more at intergroup processes and particularly topics such as prejudice, um, in-group biases and so forth. Uh, I'm sure you learned about all these topics already in the undergraduate level, but what we're gonna do in this module is really give you a much um, more in-depth perspective um, on these topics and we're really going to end with talking about different interventions that people did in the past in order to try to um, reduce um, in-group tension and basically what we can learn from the success and failures of these interventions. Um, so as I said, um, in general we hope that from these modules you'll be able to both understand why people behave the way they do uh, but also how to use this knowledge um, in your work in the future in order to really improve interactions and communication and um, that's it and i hope to see you next year